a day in the life in Alaska. Saturday was a gorgeous day, so we decided to load up the kids and go to the Alaska Scottish Games. These games take place in Palmer every year, and I've only managed to go a handful of times, but since the weather was so good, we had to make it work, and let's be honest, I just love any excuse to watch big strong men lift and throw big heavy things. There's a ton of different competitions, and I'll be honest, I don't know the rules or how to win most of them, but they're fun to watch anyway, and the crowd really gets into it. The tug of war events are always super popular, and I love that they let the kids go up and compete in between the main events. So we stayed through the finals and watched these two teams square off, and it's really fun to see this team was named Tug of Thor. They ended up winning, and then we were feeling a little hot and thirsty, so we decided to walk around, and we saw some of the different booths that were set up. There were lots of different demonstrations going on, lots of really fun food and different crafts, and then we found these two bands that were practicing and getting ready to perform. There was so much going on. We saw Irish dancing, and then we found these Scottish dogs that I don't remember the breed, but they were literally the largest dogs I have ever seen in my life. They were huge and so cute. I'm pretty sure Justin would have taken that one home if he could. And then we stopped by the soda jerk and dip and dots, and then want to watch a little bit more of the competitions. I think these look crazy hard, but of course Wyatt's confident. For this one, you were supposed to launch this log and get it to flip over. This guy did it and the crowd went wild. It was pretty sweet to watch. There were so many events, we couldn't even catch a fraction of them, but we enjoyed getting to watch what we could. Our friends recently opened up a food truck called the Alaska Mac Shack and we had to check it out. So we got macaroni to take home and some cookies that were delicious. And then we stopped by and watched this reenactment of a beheading, which was entertaining and very comical actually. On our way out, we saw this man who was playing the Outlander theme and he was getting a lot of tips. If you know, you know. And then we headed home where Lily spent the rest of the evening hunting for minnows in the lake in our backyard.